two nights ago, and he was so good. The coaching staff said, let's give him another go tonight. Here we go. Underway is the abs, and the puck in the Carolina zone. Stopped by Martin. It makes an awful lot of sense. Plus, they're loaded with talent. That puck up and out, all the way back down to the abs zone. Ajo walks in, sends it across. Stopped by Georgiev. Absolutely beautiful. He robs Roslovic. Let's take a look. I talked about Top Gun. Watch Sam Girard here put on the brakes, and there goes Sam. Backdoor. If you got a clean look at that, this will be a great. What a play by Sebastian. Oh, and that save was incredible. Redonkulous. That's been out there for a little bit, though. Not enough left in the tank to make a go of it. It's sent across by Natchez. In front, another stop by Georgiev. It's hard to believe. Remember back in the day, they used him as a bit of a winger as well. That's how he was for drafted. the Minnesota Wild. Sent in front, stop by Georgiev again. Hit that pass right across the top of the crease. The Canes contesting every single pass in the Avalanche end. Yeah, good to see John Ludwig back in. Just played one of the last eight games. A big physical Adam Foot style defense for number three. Right in front of you. And when that battle shot score. The Canes with an early 1-0 lead. It's Jack Drury. Again, fed to about five feet away from the crease. And he's able to rip it home. Carolina on top. Just his 127th NHL game. It starts with the battle down below. They got two canes on one. And right there, Parker Kelly just doesn't see behind them that a jury snuck in. That, oh boy, that was close to a save. Right off the blocker slash shoulder, Georgiev. Oh, is it ever? And that Sebastian Ajo is a tremendous hockey player. Averages 32 goals a season. They just coughed it up. Came out of front shot. Oh my goodness. What a stop by Martin. Right on his way to the bench. We'll take a look at Walker off the end boards and look at that come across as Pittsburgh's got no idea where that is. At the last second, he gets his eyes on the puck there. And I think Kiwi Ronta thought it was just going to be a guaranteed tap in and tried to get it on net as fast as he could. Maybe guys are going to get called out. You kind of pass breaking sticks and throwing water bottles like the old days, but I don't know. The TV should have been smashed. That's what should have happened. And ahead for Stahl as we are underway with the second. Stahl, hard shoot to the save by Georgia. Boy, the 20-year-old. That's why he's getting his first NHL action. He's big, he's hitting, he can skate, he can shoot the puck. Oh. Jarvis tied up in the corner, trying to spin away. Gave it up. Score! Martin Pounds it inside the far post, and the Canes have a 2-0 lead. That's all about winning puck battles in the corner. And the Canes did a great job of it. Jarvis finds Martin for his third of the season. Just down low, Avs cannot win puck battles, a little separation, and Martin of the ageless wonder, his last two years, he's had the most points he's ever had. Huge kill for the Avs, can ill afford to go down three goals. Stolen away, Kale McCarr is on the move. McCarr short-handed, slap right he scores! Superstar defenseman to come to the rescue with his sixth of the season. Hey, Shanny. Well, as we look, you can feel it coming, and you knew. Shanny, I bet you could feel that slap shot was coming, because that was kind of all he had as he was getting cornered off the side of the ice. He let the big dog eat 90 plus miles an hour. I don't know, Shanny, think you could have stopped that one? Oh, definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> Best of luck in the future. Continue to kick some major tail, all right? Thank you. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. You bet. Good Thank luck, you Shani. so much. Shani Thanks. Daly, Thanks. one of our Cancer Warriors here tonight, as McKinnon bursts in. Nate shoots it. Rebound. Score! Sam Malinsky. Top shot with a backhand. And the Avs have tied the game in two. Number 38 for young Sam Malinsky. And McKinnon just throws it at the net once again. Looking for that rebound play as I talked about earlier. Malinsky jumps, and what touch to sit there and pull that back. Going full speed, puts the brakes on, grabs it, forehand to backhand, slides it right under the arm. No shots on goal yet for Carolina. After halfway through the kill, Malinsky in the box for holding. Natchez drops it off. Spets the cop. Tried to go right wide. Jarvis is in front. Score! Natchez with the tally. A power play goal. His eighth goal of the season, and the Canes get one back. It's now a 3-2 lead.
and he just jumps on it. Then Jarvis throws it right over to Natchez, but unlucky top to bottom. Look at that play. Svechnikov goes to throw it across the ice, jumps right onto Jarvis's stick like a magic trick, and then the abs are all caught. And Natchez just, just continues his hot hand, puts it in the back. Your has got no chance. So the abs Stuff to McKinnon, and he fanned on his turnaround attempt. That puck just got away from him. Bouncing pucks here tonight. Set ahead, McKinnon tried to dart through. McKinnon held up. Now he's through. Here he comes. Dangling shooting. Score! Absolutely rocking it at pass mark. Well, McKinnon wasn't going to be shut down again on a second glorious scoring opportunity. And as he comes and watch him win the out muscle battle right here, just watch it more than Walker. Then as Miko kind of plays, the decoy opens right up. The defenseman lets him go one on one with the goaltender right there. Kicks to the side, Nate sees it. Then buries it left side, posting in. The hands, the speed. Miko. In the slot, McKinnon collapsed the box into the front. Uh, here's the reverse hit by Kale McCarr. Boy, nobody can change directions faster than Kale. Just steps up the six foot two Svechnikov. And then right here, Lekkinen. He's kind of got a little bit of a hook and he gets stuck and misses a wide open net. There's no worse feeling than that. But how do you recover? Well, you just tip in the next shot. Oh, that's a thing of beauty. Rantman throws it at the net about wrist high. Lekkinen just pulls it from the heavens and tucks it back down and right. McKinnon comes around the back of the net. Watch the right leg of Spencer Martin. McKinnon does touch it. After reviewing the play, it was determined there was no goaltender interference. On the near side, middle stat. Two to go, one to go. Rants it in, shoots, and it's blocked away. He'll gather that puck. 40 seconds to go in the 5 on 3. Score! Miko Rantanen says, I'll do it myself. Comes racing in, rips it off the bar in it. And the Avs have a 5 to 3 lead. Rantanen, his seventh of the year, expired. And the Miko says, Let's go do this thing. It felt like Rantanen was just not going to be denied. No matter what, he was going to score this goal. He was just hanging with that puck in the tops of the circles. Gets the first shot blocked. You can see the penalty killer coming out of the penalty box. And what a beautiful sound. Right off the iron. Look at the super mode. Top shelf. You actually can't have a finer shot. Right off where they weld the crossbar in the post. He tucks. Boy, might be the most fist pumps I've seen in the game, guys. Scoring. I mean, power fist pumps. He was absolutely pumped, as you would say, right? Girl, Nathan McKinnon. He'd been digging for that all night long as that pucks up in the air to begin the third period. What? Ransom had it stripped. Natchez out of Chatfield. Finish that thought momentarily. Natchez will shoot. Kicks a rebound. Score! Martinuk took it off the pad of Georgiev and makes it a 5 4 game. Less than three minutes into period number three. Sebastian Ajo drops it. Just a quick shot towards the net. Martinuk separates from Sam Girard, and that rebound could not be sitting better. You can see. The puck was knocked down by a stick, so that fooled Georgiev. It came in, lost about 20 miles an hour right there off Devontae's stick. Georgiev just tries to stop it, kicks it right to Martin. McKinnon taking the draw. Jarvis in for the Kings. That puck is down. Scrambled for. Lifted. Taken by Ratton. Fires all the way down and scores. Miko Ranton in an empty net goal. His second goal of the game. And that will put it away. Nathan McKinnon, who battles for this draw, is going to get his fourth point of the night. 29 points on the season now for the great Nate. Crowd here at Ball Arena loves it. And that will do it. The Avs with five goals in the second period. An empty netter here in the third. And they skate away with the two points against Carolina.